please like, comment, and subscribe. Back to the spiritual principle that, or as I heard it at least, um, that any manifestation is sort of the perfect, most economical or um, effective manifestation for everybody involved. Um, it might, it feels a little bit sort of cynical old paradigm to, to want to ask the question, if that's true, what role does observation, reflection, even thought or feeling about anything have to do with our experience, our incarnation? Because if it's all going to happen perfectly anyway, why should I reflect on it? Okay, back to it's being math. Okay? If you change the formula, the result changes. Observation means that when you look at something you're part of and training yourself to observe, you will notice different things. You will bring in different perspectives. And it means that when you repeat, it will have a different result. Every time you expand the awareness of what is taking place or manifesting, it will learn and grow. So it's not necessarily changing the manifestation you're already part of, the manifestation you are observing, but through the observation, you can learn and evolve. So it's about the next step. 